is Dubai. How are you doing, cutting hair, sir? He's focusing. And today, we're looking for the most expensive haircut we could get in the city versus one of the cheapest. Uh, did you disinfect? So I brought one of my boys up. It's this up. is Victor. I like Crocs, I not, like... not body my ass. Oh, <laughs> but the only thing is we don't know who's gonna get which haircut. So I have a Durham here, which is Dubai's currency. Yeah. Be my guest. I want okay, heads. I'm just like, I've been waiting six months for this haircut. I think it's time to go, right? Well, I hope you get the good one because uh, this yeah, is all yeah. on your hands. Go, go ahead. ahead. One, two, and... Tell us. No! Oh, yeah, boy! <laughs> Have you ever seen me get a good haircut? Definitely not. Never. Never. Is that what you were talking about last time? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think? Not too long? Not long enough? He's waited six months to cut his hair. I was like, I was like, I gotta wait for the video. It's just, you know, that's why it's so grungy. I like the aesthetic of this place. It's like all marble and gold. The lights are like Rolls Royce lights. Man, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot of hair, right? <laughs> What's the price? Like the craziest haircut here with all, with all the different add-ons and everything like that. Okay, with everything? Yes, like the facials, the gold. I see you guys put a gold mask. That's a lot. That's a, it's a lot. A thousand dollars? No. Oh, 80. Okay, I was like, oh shoot, <laughs> what I get myself into? Okay, a thousand is uh, maybe about two hundred and seventy dollars, right? So it's a thousand dirhams equals out to two hundred and seventy dollars around there. That's pretty pricey, to be honest. Yeah, boy, yeah. Oh shoot, where before? Germany. Germany. So you, you switched from Germany over here. Damn, okay. So you like it way better here? Absolutely. Hell yeah. Safety, Why is it there like no violence in the city? Because there are too many security cameras. Okay. Most all over. Mm, okay. So I've seen Logan Paul come through. I show speed. So I was here. You're here? Yeah, yeah. How is he? He's cool? cool bro. Hell yeah. But he's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he did that too? How long have you been barbering for? 16. 16 years. Damn. Okay. How long did it take to complete a whole haircut? About three hours. You take you take three hours for a haircut? Everything. Ooh, I'm in for a good one today. I've never had a service for three hours. I would love that, but unfortunately today I'm getting the cheapest one I could find, which is Yeah, and you get that in less than 10 minutes. The cheapest one? Yeah. Of course, we all know we can't rush an artist when working on a masterpiece, so our barber Kelvin taking his time was a huge reason why this haircut was probably so expensive. Everything from the aesthetic of this place to the great customer service made us feel like we were drowning in royalty. Most of you guys are used to clips. This is another life hack that Kelvin just showed me. <laughs> he literally puts the freaking comb right on it instead of like a clip and then he just keeps fading and not. That's pretty cool. I literally learned something from this haircut. You literally gotta book a flight from America to Dubai, come get a haircut, come back. That's about uh, $4,000, $3,000, but it's okay. You're the manager around here? Yeah. Ah, okay. So if I wanted to uh, come work here, I would have to talk to you. Yeah, sure. Can I work here? <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what does that mean? I can't afford you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate that. That's a, such a compliment. I'll take that one. Thank you. The haircut itself was looking top notch, but meanwhile, Victor was enjoying that. I had to treat myself as well. He's the one that did Speed's manicure. She's going to show me a little snippet right now. Oh, shoot. That's so sick. The little cuckoo. Oh, Fat Joe. Can you do mine? Okay. Yes, yes. Oh, this is my first time getting manicure. I have ugly feet. <laughs> Man, I'm pretty sure a lot of men have ugly feet, no? Like if you're athletic and shit. <laughs> They're just laughing back there. Bro. It's okay, it's okay. Right? It's okay. When I go to beach, I don't want girls to see my feet because I don't like it. <laughs> it's okay, that's why I'm here. Oh. <laughs> That's like the perfect answer. Yeah, it's the purpose of manicure. Right? It's actually no joke, bro. I wasn't prepared for this and it feels so good. So I've never gotten a manicure, but she's actually doing a very good job. I thought it was gonna hurt, but not at all. It actually feels very good. I feel like the rocks popping through my freaking fingers in here. Why, yes, I was clearly having a blast. And Victor? Victor was getting an experience of a lifetime. Whoa. Woo! Jesus, help me. <laughs> oh! Lord, Lord have mercy. Oh, whoa, we can breathe a lot better. Wow, so this is so much better. Look at that. How long you been doing this for? I'm here for 16 years. 16 years? Oh my God. Oh, that feels good, bro. That feels good. Oh God. I mean, that's pretty hard, but it's good, it's good. I'm gonna just relax. Okay, now it doesn't feel as bad. The first time you did it, I was really tense, right? 
My muscle or what? Oh my god, bro. I swear, dude, I thought he was gonna take out some like metal and really like go into my teeth or something, but no. That was definitely some payback, wasn't it? Yeah, my pores really needed some cleaning there. Thank you so much, honestly. Thank you, thank you so much. This is the best experience I could have gotten for my first manicure. Seriously. Don't, don't, yeah, don't show my feet. <laughs> but no, hand wise, boom. Foot, you all can see my feet. I'm pretty sure they've came out on camera before, but hey. But you see 10 out of 10. No, yes, thank you so much. Now, there was no doubt we didn't mind being pampered for a few hours as grown men. Yo, he's like half asleep. <laughs> That's how you know it's a good experience. You guys clean as fuck. That's nice. So, okay, first of all, she's saying my feet look beautiful now. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I feel like I have clean feet, like the cleanest feet I've ever had. So, thank you, Eddie. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> God, I've never had a freaking calf massage, but it feels good. Yeah, super. Oh my. It's like she goes harder when the camera's in her face to get the camera out of her face, bro. <laughs> Look, I knew I was in for a treat when they said it was going to be an expensive experience, but this was on another level. The amount of effort and detail was just on point. I think this is the best cut I've gotten. I saw someone using fire. You over there like getting a pedicure, manicure. You missed the fire. The fire was here, bro. I feel like I'm walking on cloud. The fire was like here, dude. <laughs> like, like all over my head. Okay, so what went on? Can I see fire one more time? <laughs> Sergio Ramos from the front. Ramos! Oh, there we go, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. It looks so much better than the picture we showed him, so thank you, Kelvin. You outdid yourself, seriously. I actually never thought I'd be giving anybody this high of a rating, but Kelvin definitely scored a 10 out of 10 on my end. You get to punch that little punching bag right there, the money punch. Oh my oh. god, there's no way I'm doing that. God, dude, the max freaking scores a thousand, bro. I'm pretty sure you're the security guard here, too. No? <laughs> this is my first time. Ready? Okay, it's not as bad as I thought it'd be. That's my first try ever. That's not bad. Yeah, get it. Oh, Ooh, no, bro. It's a haircut. He was too relaxed. He was too relaxed. Go, get it one more time. Yes, I punched. How much? I got 800 something. Okay, he got 700. Wait, I do want to ask you one thing. How do you feel about your haircut? 10 out of 10 go. You got us right. Thank you Thank so you. much. All right, let's take a little pick and go to the cheapest one we could possibly find. <laughs> Unfortunately, now it was my turn, but come on, what can go wrong? We're in Dubai. Nice to meet you, sir. You said 35 dirhams? Yeah. Okay. We paid 200 and something dollars earlier for that haircut. Now we're paying literally a fraction for $9, probably even less, I don't know. Make sure we keep the bulk right here, okay? Oh yes, I have a lot of clay. I already know what he's doing. He's like parting perfectly. Hey, you're gonna love this. I swear, like, it's gonna be the most perfect, delightful experience of your life. Hey, hey, don't be nervous. He knows what he's doing. Uh, did he disinfect? Yeah, did he, he disinfect? Like, yeah, okay. How long you been cutting hair, sir? He's focusing. Okay, I'm just gonna sit down, chill. How old are you? Uh, how old? How old are you? Huh? How old are you? <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, not being able to understand your barber is quite frustrating, especially when you're extremely picky with your haircut. Looking fantastic. Phenomenal. You know what? I can't deal with your sarcasm today. <laughs> Look, at, Look at it. Excellence in the making. Okay, so the real question is, when am I going to win a coin toss? Japan? Um, comment down below if you want to see us go to Japan or any other country. Comment down which country, actually. Honestly? I think it's Japan. Japan? Everything Japanese is super sharp. That's pretty good. Pretty good. You have like some paste or something? Like a, a, a plate? Paste? Yes, gel? Look like Jimmy Neutron. No? No, he, no. Damn. Oh, sh Oh my god. You're good, you're good. Ouch. That. One, two, three. Oh, mother. Ha ha ha. Is, do I actually really have a lot? Okay, that's not bad. It's not bad. What was your name? Jafar Ali. Jafar Ali. Okay. Nice to meet you. Thank yeah. you so much for the haircut. I truly appreciate you. Ricky, can you grab him? The cat? I got this one. Don't worry. How much was it? 35. 35. Thank you so much, sir. I appreciate you. Overall, the haircut wasn't the greatest, but it wasn't the worst. I'd say our barber, Jeff Forelli, scored a decent 5 out of 10. And hey, within 10 minutes, his effort towards a reference picture was pretty accurate. 
So this was the cheapest barbershop I could find in Dubai, but the interesting thing about it is there's literally G-Wagons and Range Rovers right outside, which doesn't make any sense. G-Wagons and Range Rovers here in Dubai are basically Honda Civics, Honda right? Civics. Seriously, yeah. like they're just everywhere. It doesn't matter if it's a cheap place, if it's like a mid-range place. All right, guys, so that concludes the cheapest versus the most expensive haircut you could get here in Dubai. Yeah. What do you have to say about I your had haircut? an amazing experience. Yeah, yeah uh, I'm, I'm on about the other you? side. I mean, you? I saw the back of my head. I don't know, it looks, it looks great. It looks nice and level. Whatever, bro. Like, I'm just gonna wait to the next country. Comment down below which country you want us to visit next. That's it for me. I'm Marty Blends. It's Victor. And, and we're, we're out. out. Peace. Peace.